There is a belief out there that our bodies are naturally supposed to use glucose or carbs for energy rather than fats. But if that's the case, why can our body hold 77,000 calories of fats and only 1,600 calories of glycogen? Now remember, your body has been designed by evolution for millions of years to survive so that you can procreate. That's why when you tan, your skin gets darker. It's because your body's adapting to the stress from the sunlight and getting darker so that next time the sunlight won't hurt it as much. And we see it in the form of calluses too. You could rub sandpaper on your hand and it's, your hand's gonna start bleeding. But in a few days, your skin's gonna get tougher and stronger in a form of a callus so that next time it can handle the stress. So if carbs or glycogen were meant to be our go-to fuel, then why would evolution only allow us to have 1600 calories of our main source of fuel? Wouldn't that make it less likely for us to survive because it would limit our energy? On top of that, when we eat foods high in carbs, it spikes our insulin, which stops us from being able to access fat for energy, which would limit our chances of surviving even more. And also, why are there essential amino acids and essential fatty acids, but no essential carbs or essential glycogen? Remember that essential means that it's necessary for our bodies to survive. It's all of these reasons that lead me to believe that fats are meant to be our source of fuel. Now the problem with using glucose or carbs as a main source of fuel is that your body hasn't evolved from that for millions of years and it's not gonna work as optimally. And you may be experiencing some of the side effects. Do you constantly seem tired and get bad sleep and have trouble losing weight? Or do you constantly get sick and have mental fog? Well, these might be signs that your glucose burning body is holding you back. And if you believe in evolution, then you also agree that your body shouldn't have all these issues. Because how would having these issues help you survive? No, clearly there's something else going on here. What you need to realize is that when you eat foods, those foods are literally sending instructions to your cells. And those instructions could be to turn on genes you want on or turn on genes you actually want off. And this is called epigenetics. And keep in mind, this is science. There's no disputing it. Now, what happens when you send your cells the wrong instructions is that your body stops functioning well. And on the opposite side of the spectrum, you could eat the right foods that it's evolved from, and it's gonna make you feel superhuman and limitless. This is exactly why the second foundation of the new era of health is eating clean. We eat foods that we've evolved from for millions of years and affect how we are hardwired as humans so that we can become fat adapted. Because when you become fat adapted, you eliminate sugar cravings, increase mental clarity profoundly, but you also get better skin, improve your mood, sleep, and you burn fat effortlessly. Could you imagine losing 15 pounds in one month without running or exercising? I know I can, because that's what happened to me and many others just like you when we became fat adapted. But this is only the beginning of the power of becoming fat adapted. Because when you become fat adapted, you notice a change in yourself, how you view the world and what you're capable of. You start to excel at your job because you have mental clarity and the energy to produce the results you want. And you no longer crash at 2 p.m. just sitting there for three hours waiting for it to be five. The reason is because fats are a much more efficient source of fuel than glucose. You no longer get those blood sugar spikes, which are those times you just crash and get grumpy and angry until you slam down more carbs. And when you eliminate this, you wake up energized, you have more energy at work, and even when you get home. How much happier would your kids be if you came home and had more energy to go play with them? They wait all day for you to get home so that you guys can play together because that's how they see love. That's how they share their love with you. And vice versa, when you play with them, it shows that you love them. Imagine how much more they would think you'd love them if you could play with them for an hour longer than you do each day because your energy wasn't limiting you. And are you aware that children that get more attention and love turn out to be happier and more successful as they grow up? So shouldn't you as a loving parent want that for your children? Well, all you need to do for that is become fat adapted because when you're fat adapted, you become limitless. And that's why in the new era of health, we make sure that you build the metabolic state to utilize fats for energy. So if you're ready to change how you view your life and how you feel, then I invite you to download the new era of health 21 day total body transformation so that you can become fat adapted. If you want that, hit the link in the description, enter in your email and I'll send it out to you. Leave a comment and tell me why you want to become fat adapted. If you like this video, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, leave me a comment. It really helps me with growing the channel and getting my message across to more people just like you.